Hey everybody, the Bong is here, yet to give you one of my biggest Let's Plays to date. That's right, I'm going to Let's Play Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. And boys, let me tell you, I think uh, we got a big snow day so I can actually, you know, take a day off from work so I can actually get started on recording this, you know? And besides, I've been working a lot, so I needed a break. Yeah, I'm gonna enter my name all in capital letters because I rock like that. Good thing there was enough room for six letters. Help me! Please help me! I am a prisoner in the dungeon of my own fucking castle! My name is Zelda! The wizard of Ganon has done something to the other girls, probably sodomizing them with a lead pipe, but... Whatever, not only I remain, but Ganon has seized control of the castle and is now trying to open the Seven Wise Men's seal. I am in the dungeon of the castle, I just think you never heard that the first fucking time. Please help me. Alright, Bong, I'm going to go out for a while. Uh, probably going to be begging some hookers, I'll be back by morning. Can you please not leave the house, because I don't want you to see me like this. Okay, so apparently there was this golden land around Hyrule that was causing some people to fight for it because they were corrupted by power. So the king sent seven wise men to go out and seal that land. But the wizard of Ganem appeared and killed the king and now wants the descendants of the seven wise men, which are maidens, to be locked away in the land of darkness. That way the seal will be lifted and again I wants that power for himself. Sounds like a pretty fucked up story, right? But apparently Zelda is one of the seven descendants, so we gotta save her. Yes, I've played this game before many times, I know about that hidden hole. And what's gonna make this Let's Play really good, but probably really long, is I'm gonna try to get every single heart piece there is to collect. Oh, thank god we got the sword. Die, uncle! Yeah, I'm gonna give you a haircut, huh? Okay, fuck you then. Oh, I love swapping at random soldiers. It's so awesome. Yeah, I've been calling down to my work like a few times this morning, and since I did not get a response, and the uh, website for that place said that all departments are closed until further notice. I said, hey, I might as well stay in for a bit. I mean, it's not like I'm doing anything wrong. It's like I have checked to see if it was open. Since I didn't get a response, hey, that's my excuse. Also, I'm testing ZSNES on a different screen resolution, so hopefully it comes up pretty good. Because I noticed all the other times I've been emulated, I get this other blank bar around it which makes the screen a little bit smaller on YouTube. So hopefully, if I test the resolution, it'll come out a little bit better. To save the princess we go. Yeah, I'm gonna set you on fire. Uh, the lamp is useless against enemies. Oh, well, against soldiers, anyway. All right, we got some free papers. Now let's smoke some weed. I mean, that's a map, okay? Okay, to use the map, you have to hit the X button. Okay, apparently I gotta go this way to B3. B3? You sunk my battleship! Haha! <laughs> Fall to your doom! Fall to your doom, too! Death by pot for the win! Well, oh, those pots must be very strong to kill those blue soldiers in one hit, wouldn't you agree? Yeah, do you really think I'm going to actually be able to get all the hard pieces here in this game? It's going to take a lot of luck and a lot of patience. So I've never been able to do it. But I guess we're going to be able to find out, right? Alright, the boomerang! My favorite sub-weapon. And not only Zelda and Castlevania. Okay, where's this key go? Yeah, the locked door, wouldn't you guess? I have a feeling we're gonna make a lot of progress in this video. 
Yes, I know what to do. Money, money, money! I want it! I want it! Big key for the win! Oh, thank you, Bug. I had a feeling you were getting close. Blah, blah, blah. Where's the controlling the soldiers? Uh, you fear the worst of your father, but we already know he's dead. Yeah, apparently we gotta find the secret path around the first floor. There, I saved you a lot of bit of time with that dialogue. I know enough of the game story anyway. The good thing about having Zelda follow you around is at least this does not feel like an escort mission. Usually escort missions you have to like watch over the person you're protecting and he or she can get hurt. But Zelda gets ineffective by anything, which is good, so you can keep going without consequence. Though we have to make sure we do not get killed, of course. That's obvious. You suck. I'm not gonna waste any time to fight all these enemies. All I'm gonna get mostly is money. Probably won't even get any bombs till like later in the game. Ah, damn it, I took my first hit. Yeah, that's what's so useful about the boomerang, in case you're too lazy to get an item. Go! Alright, fuck him then. Sure, the old man there will help you. Uh, why does Zelda rely so much on old men these days? Like, maybe the reason your daddy hasn't been around in your life is because maybe he's, um, I, I, I don't know, killed? My god, Zelda, grow up! You're becoming worse than Princess Peach. That's saying something. Alright, trying to refill on some magic. Well, apparently the rats do not get killed by the boomerang, you just have to stun them. Okay, no more using the boomerang for a while. We gotta light our way up. Look around for something. Let's go deeper. Snakes! I'm headed up to here with these motherfucking snakes in the motherfucking underground tunnel! And another thing I like to do for this Let's Play, I am not going to save state on any bosses in the game. I don't care which ones you are, I will not save state to them. Including that worm in the Tower of Hera that knocks you into that pit and you have to start over. I will actually keep playing through it until I beat it. No low stating through that or nothing. Who knows, I may not have to low state at all unless I get to a path to where I was. Or unless I get caught in random backtracking, which I do not want to do. Thought you stupid rat. That's why you're rats, because you're stupid. rat hold a key anyway. Like, you think with all that running, you just let it go or something. Once again, video game logic.
I see those cracks in the wall. You cannot get through there without bugs. So we'll have to come back here later. God damn it. There. Anyways, we are going to stop right there. I think that's enough footage for now, so stay tuned for the next part. See ya!